Hey, Shalom, Shalom. First and foremost, we'll give all praise, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father and His Son, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakadash. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of GMS who rule well. Peace and blessings to the hopeful elect. Hey, this is GMS Arkansas. Come on, a short lesson. Uh, looking through a news feed. I saw a video, so I'm going to get the news feed on it to read it. Uh, it says, scorned by Trump, many Nigerians love him all the same. See, scorned, made fun of, dogged out by this Edomite, but many Nigerians love him the same. In Lagos, hundreds of men and women marched clad in t-shirts supporting U.S. President Donald Trump or pink fabric dresses bearing the image of Jesus, okay? As they waved American flags, Republican presidential campaign signs, and even a few Nigerian flags, the rally, after all, was uh, Onitsha in Onitsha, a city in eastern Nigeria. Trump was disbarred. African has disbarred. It's disparaged African nations, calling them shitholes. Okay, this doesn't surprise me. But you Jakes, like a lot of you Nigerians is Jakes, okay? Now, it's a video to it. Like, uh, I don't know if this is the video. No, this is one of them ones in the States. This It's a video to it showing them uh, Nigerians walking down the street. Basically, uh, having a rally for, for Donald Trump. But like a lot of them, Jake's, you gotta remember, man. You you went into captivity, man. You just lost it all. All the knowledge you had, you lost it, man. And a lot of people say you Nigerians are the smartest black people on the earth, man. But damn, uh, don't you don't look too smart? Okay, this man is dog. You out scoring. You call you shitos, and you still love him because. You people, you love your slave master, man. Israelites love their slave master, no matter where they at, man. We were scattered across the four corners of the globe, okay, for one. Okay. Uh, let me get that Deuteronomy 28. Deuteronomy 28 and... Deuteronomy 28, 64. And the Lord shall scatter thee among all people from one end of the earth, even unto the other, and there shall they shall serve other gods, which neither nor thy father have known, either wood or stone. So you are Israelites in Nigeria, man. A lot of you people, when I saw the video, a lot of them, they, they jakes, man. Okay, you serve in, you serve in Chesare. You serve in another god, man. That's why the Lord is destroying you, okay. He's going to destroy you. You people, I'm going to show you. You have been led into captivity. And you suffer. For the lack of knowledge. And I'm going to get that script. Okay. Papa Kasha. Isaiah 5 and 13. Therefore my people are going into captivity. Okay. And it says because they have not no knowledge. And their honorable men are famished. And their multitude dried up with thirst, man. The thirst for the truth. You know? Because the scripture tell you here, you would think, why would they even uh, be loving Trump like that? But the scripture tell you right here in uh, Proverbs 11 and 21, uh, it says, though hand join in hand, it says, though hand join in hand, the wicked shall not go unpunished. But the seed of the righteous shall be delivered. Okay. So do hand join the hand. The wicked shall not go unpunished. And a lot of you people like to be, uh, feel like. Especially uh, you. Uh, I noticed them uh, Israelites in Africa man. They really like Esau. Because Esau let them come to the states. And make a little money. And they can send back home. And become you know rich over here. So basically man. They, they loving it man. Okay. But you can you can walk hand in hand with this Edomite, but you're still gonna be destroyed. You're gonna be destroyed with him. 
It say you su you suffer, man. You okay? Verse it was at thirteen. Uh, it says, therefore, hell has enlarged herself and opened her mouth without measure. So you catching hell, man. No matter how much you root for Trump, you still catching hell because this is the earth. Earth is giving it to the hands of the wicked. It's giving it to the so-called white man. He's running. He has his he has his uh, unrighteous decrees going out. He has his laws for you to go by, for you to abide by, to keep you in subjection. And soon come, he's going to bring an RFID technology out to basically uh, chip you and to put you in further slavery, okay? Put you back into that that that, uh, that slavery where it could be hardcore if you wish. Because the situation, they're going about to make the situation bad out here. To the point you think there ain't going to be no, nowhere to turn. And then they're going to offer you this, this technology that's going to feed you. Okay, this is supposed to be convenient. It's gonna take care of you, but actually, it's gonna be your demise if you take it. Okay, you know people are that root for Trump. Them same Nigerians, they are gonna be taking that RFID chip. Okay, it shows you that they lack uh, they lack knowledge, man. They ain't into the scriptures. They ain't they in uh, sweet baby Ray Jesus. This Hosea four and six. My people are destroyed for the lack of knowledge. Because thou hast rejected knowledge, I will also reject thee. That thou shalt be no more priest to me, to me, seeing thou hast forgotten the law of thy power. I shall, I will, I will also forget my children. That's what you see happening, man. People are losing their minds, trying to be still hand in hand with these Edomites. Knowing these Edomites, they have not cared for you. Okay. Uh, this is Lamentations 4. And 17. As for us, our eyes are yet failed for our vain help. In our watching, we have watched for a nation that could not save us, man. And that's what they do. <laughs> hey, Amen. They think these Edomites going to save them. Nobody can save you but Yahweh Shai. And that's and that's for the uh the elect the hundred and forty four thousand the multitude. Okay. But a lot of you a lot of them hey them them like I said them Nigerian Israelites, you looking on Esau help you, okay? All y'all wanna do is get to America and drive a cab and shit. Okay. You Israelites, a lot of y'all Israelites as well, so you're gonna suffer more. You suffering because you had the lack of knowledge, man. Okay. You should be calling on the name of Yahweh Bashim Yahushai, putting all your trust in Yahweh Bashim Yahushai. But yeah, you put your trust in another God, which is so called white man. You Nigerians are bad at that, man. This man just said that nation can't save us, man. It can't save you. Okay? Only Yahweh Bashim Yahushai. So, hey, with that, call Halal Yahweh Bashim Yahushai, Bashim Kodash. Double honor to the apostles and the elders of GMS who rule well. Peace and blessings to the hopeful elect brothers out there on the four corners of the globe. Pushing this truth, the truth of sincerity and strength. Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. Till the next time, Shalom.